Okay, man, on this video, follow along and do what I do on your computer. You're going to be taking screenshots every now and then. I'm logged in as one of the students, so my permissions are going to be the same as yours. So what I'm going to do is first go to Start, All Programs, Accessories, and then Command Prompt. We talked about one of the ways a hacker can gain, or something a hacker might want to gain access to is a command prompt. Windows, this used to be the basis of Windows. Windows would run on top of it. This was something called DOS, or Disk Operating System. Windows 7 is independent of it, but there's still this uh, bare-bones interface exists that you can interact with. And once you're at this screen, you have to type in everything by hand. So say I wanted to go from at showing the H drive, which is probably Teresa, to the hard drive, which is the C drive, I would have to type in C colon to change drives. If I wanted to see what was in there, I would type in DIR for directory. And if there's too many things, type in DIR slash W. And what that does is put it into columns. If I wanted to change into, let's say, this videos directory or folder, I would type CD for change directory videos dir and if there's something in there like spec 7 wmv that's a video from another class or setting up uh, outlook that looks like another video so i'm going to type in spec 7.wmv you may not have some but it would take a picture a uh, screenshot of you um, in this folder or a different one for right now but what i can do is i can execute files from here. So you can run, just as you can run things in here, a hacker. A hacker could uh, set it up so we could stop the firewall other processes. So by trying to run that video, it brings up Windows Media Player, which runs that. I'm going to X out of there. Now another thing, uh, to get back to the hard drive, CD dot dot, there are other commands you can run to get system info. So I'm going to type in ipconfig IPCONFIG, which is the IP or Internet Protocol configuration, and hit enter. And if I scroll up, it's too much information to fit on one screen. What I'm looking for is the IP address of this computer. So right here, IPv4 address shows me the exact address of this computer. So that is very useful in, uh, in, in terms of uh, knowing where a computer is. Also there's other more uh, sophisticated information that uh, a hacker might be able to find. So take a screenshot of this and email that to me or you can type in if you need more information config space and then a slash all and it lists probably way more information than you can ever need, but that will tell you uh, a lot of information about the computer. So we'll stop there with this, take a screenshot, and send it to me, please.